New Tonight at 6, it's been months since the pandemic started, and people in our area are still waiting for unemployment benefits. News 9's Amanda Lojeski talked to a single mom just trying to make ends meet. She joins us in Wausau with the, her story. As a single mother, Carmen Nichols has tried to figure it all out on her own, but now she's worried what may happen to her kids if she doesn't get help soon. This is Carmen, a single mother of two who is taking care of everything on her own and never asked for help, but now she does. I have like, I have like $120 left and I, I do, I have like $120 left in my name. Working as a coil winder for the past six years. I actually made too much money to get any kind of help for anything. But work was slow. I started a part-time job on a potato farm because we were slow and I worked Friday and Saturday so it was like 12 12 hour days. Then her full time job called her back, so she quit her part time job. And now, because of the pandemic, they laid off every other week again, forcing her to file for unemployment in April. That claim still pending. And you either couldn't get through, you got hung up on, or when you finally got through, they told you just to keep filing. There's nothing I can tell you. We don't know nothing. And then when I finally got through to somebody, they would they would give you this run around and say, well, your case is pending. Well, I know that I can see that. Then July 4th rolls around. She gets a call that she can go back to work, but little did she know. I had never missed a single day, not a single day. And I continued to be that way until I got sick. Testing positive for COVID-19 while still doing her best to make ends meet while she continues to wait and wait. I'm exhausting my FMLA. I have Two weeks left, then what? And if she doesn't get the help she needs, she could lose everything. Wisconsin's unemployment rate for the month of September was 5.4%, which was down from August's rate of 6.3%. I did reach out to the Department of Workforce Development, but did not hear back for comment. In Wausau, Amanda Lojeski, News 9 WAOW.